ni SD, may konting master lang tayo around the campus and then diretsyo na tayo sa building of faculty of um, medicine and surgery para sa basic training. Sa core training din, balik na tayo dito sa Hanna Podcast. Okay, thank you. Roll ka lang na mabilis. Sabihin nyo present pag at dito. Dizon Emanuel. Present po. Present po. Uh, <laughs> this video is we're going to USD campus because we will attend a seminar there so yun yun excited kami oo akala akala ko magkocommute kami may may pa service si mayor sana all baka naman NPC okay sinasabi ko say it yun We're on our way, pero kakaano pa lang namin, kakalis pa lang namin. Sana naririnig nyo ako. <laughs> so, shout out to Jasmir. Mainggit ka. <laughs> And kay Marge. Pagaling ka. <laughs> Yung dalawa kong friend, hindi nakasama. For a reason. Yung isa kasi mamaya may report. Eh, hindi pa niya nagagawa yung report niya. Yung isa naman, emergency. It's my first time going there in USD, which is University of Santo Tomas. Mamaya na guys. Ibablog ko yung buong campus. Alam na yung mga students there. <laughs> Sabi ni Sir, lunok-lunok muna. <laughs> Magpigil. Kasi syempre, different place, different people na makakasalamuha mo. Mamaya muna. Kami orasal, love, hope, and charity. Ito mga 1920s dito. Pero ang original campus ng USD is nasa Intramuros. Pero wala na. Statue na lang. Yung art doon, yung art show doon sa Intramuros doon. Yun yung galing sa Intramuros. Pinakaharap dito. Yung ano lang siya. Kasi parang may front and back. Yung nasa back, yung yung original. Nasa front, parang recopy na lang. Kasi parang pinitin siya. Kaya mas lumating na yun sa dito. Tapos bawal lumabas from here yung, ano, yung mga students. May pamahiin. Pamahiin lang. Kasi, yung, oh, kasi yung matidebar, 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 hindi ka makakagad. Hindi ka pag lumabas ka na hindi, na hindi yan. Dapat kasi dadaan lang doon pag first year na pag-graduate. Para lulusog sa daan. Pero pag napaaga ka ng daan ulit, hindi ka nag-graduate. Well, hindi ko tinry lumabas. Oo, hindi try. Tinry ko nung ano, nung undergrad ako. Tinry ko nung undergrad ako. So guys, so, ito nandito na kami. We arrived na kanina and we discussed some fun facts here in the USD. Ang lawak ng USD na to. And also, lalo na yung ground nila, yung field. Walang wala yun sa NPC. <laughs> Kung baga sa NPC, parang playground lang nila yun. So baka naman, pa-extend natin yung NPC. <laughs> <laughs> nila, hindi, joke lang. So, yun nga. Naka-inspired mag-aral kapag ganun ka, kalaki at kaganda ng school nyo. Hindi ko naman sa minamalit yung NPC, pero syempre, di ba? 
hindi natin matatanggi. Oh, malaki talaga. Yung playground natin. <laughs> Pero syempre, proud rin kami diyan kami nag-aral. <laughs> so papunta naman kami sa museum ni sinasabi niya. Guys, nasaan yung two lines? Child. Two lines. <laughs> nag CR mo na kami. And may, may mga nag CR pa. Feel na feel nila yung CR dito. Hindi ka tulad sa NPC. Hindi <laughs> na daw yung school natin. <laughs> Alam mo naman, pag private, di ba? Expected mo na maganda CR. Kaya mapapatagal ka. <laughs> dito. Nakatenga kami dito. Kasi hinihintay namin yung iba namin kasamahan. Sayang ang Kojik. Hindi, ba't wala kang bra? Oh my goodness! Art appreciation. Alam mo naman, art yung ganon. Everybody, we train people who come here to do CPR, and we were trained by the American Heart Association. So, the UST is the first university that is accredited with the American Heart Association. So, many of our instructors here, we were all trained by the AHA. Why do we train? Because we want to spread the learning to everybody. Gusto namin lahat ng community, lahat ng tao sa community marunong mag-CPR. Very, very important ang CPR because it can be life-saving. Huwag yung isipin na, ay, college pa lang ako, ay, high school pa lang ako. Hindi ko kailangan matutunan yan. What if somebody in your family lang nag-collapse? At least you know what to do, right? And pwede kayong tumulong sa inyong community. They can depend on you to be maybe life-saver during situations like that. So, ang gagawin natin ngayon, ito yung CPR in schools, hands-only CPR. As you can see, we have mannequins that are designed for you. No? Hindi kailangan doktor, hindi kailangan nurse, lahat dapat maruno. Okay? So, what are we going to do now? Susundan so, lang natin yung video. Manonood tayo ng video. Hindi ako magle-lecture kasi baka kayo makatulog. Manonood kayo ng video. Susundan nyo kung ano yung napanood nyo sa video. Okay? Um, before anything else, you know each other, right? You don't have to introduce each other. I'm Dr. Ruby Johnson. Uh, I'm the Training Center Coordinator of UST FMS NSPC. And I welcome you all on behalf of the JIs here who are taking care of you. Uh, I, I welcome you all. Now, uh, since our activity medyo nakakapago, pero I'm sure kaya nyo naman ang baka pa kayo eh. Is there anyone who has uh, medical problems? May sakit sa puso, may sakit sa baga, hindi hingal, pag napapagod, wala. May sakit sa likod, sa tukod. Okay, yung for the ladies, uh, pero mga pregnant, na, okay. So lahat pwedeng mag-CPR ngayon ng bongga-bongga, right? Okay? Sige. So this is hands-only CPR for school. So we will follow, we will watch the video. So we will practice pushes 
yun yung CPR. I need 10 people. So, the first 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay. So, this we want to hear the click. Do that now. There. Good, good. O, di pa yan, ha? Gusto ko lang marinig yung click. Marinig yung click. 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 Okay ka na dyan? Okay na kayo? Elbow straight. Good. Elbow straight. Alam nyo yung secret? Alam nyo yung secret para hindi kayo mapagod? Diretso yung elbows. Hindi pwede yung parang... So, lahat ng lakas nyo manggagaling sa balikat. Okay? Direct. Good. Very good. Yes. That's it. That's it. Tama, tama. Follow him. Okay, everyone ready? So, susundan natin yung video. Susundan natin yung video. Sabi ng video, put one hand on the center of the chest, put the other hand on top, and then we start. Mas maganda siguro, pakinggan natin yung tugtog para hindi tayo masyado mabilis or masyadong mabaga. Okay? So, the JLs, you can clap with me so that they can be in rhythm. Okay? Let's start. Push. Okay. Okay. See you. Thank you. Practice with my mama. Yes, you can take your seats. Take your seats. Okay. So, nakita nyo kung paano mag-CTR si Aling Lidya. Hindi siya parang nahihirapan, di ba? Relax na relax na. Dapat ganun tayo, hindi yun bang madali na parang... Kasi, kaya siya hindi nahihirapan, tama yung position niya ng CTR. Ano yung sabi namin? Lulukod kayo, di ba? And then, arms straight. Saan magdagaling yung lakas? Sa shoulders, hindi sa katawan, hindi sa puwet, hindi sa arms. Okay? Now, marami pa tayong practice session kaya huwag kayong mag-alala. If you did not do it the right time, the right way, the first time, ulit-ulit siya na sa mapagod kayo. Now, ngayon, sasaisipin nyo, sino ang nangangailangan ng CPR? Ako ba ngayon kailangan ko ng CPR? Siguro mamaya pagkatapos, no? Hindi, <laughs> if a person is talking to you, hindi nila kailangan ng CPR. But if you see somebody unconscious, no? Naglalakad kayo, uy, merong tao, walang malay. So, kailangan, isipin nyo, kailangan ba ng tao nito ng CPR? So, what are the steps? First, bago kayo lumapit dun sa victim who is lying on the ground, make sure that the scene, yung paligid nyo, safe. Safe. Para kanino? Para kanino nyo iche-check na safe yung paligid? Para dun sa victim, eh, makapatay na nga siya, no? O para sa inyo? Para sa inyo, sa rescuer. Sa tingin nyo, kung sa tingin nyo na kung hindi safe, huwag kang lalapit. Okay, I will give you examples. Uh, meron isang tao unconscious, hinimatay sa gitna ng EDSA. Tatakbo ba kayo para mag-CPR? Hindi. Because the scene is not safe. Unless, meron mga traffic enforcer, in-stop yung traffic para sa inyo para mag-CPR. Pwede. You heard that there is a person unconscious sa loob ng nasusunog na ba? Papasok kayo para mag-CPR. Hindi. May nalulunod, pero hindi kayo marunong lumangoy. Pupunta kayo? Hindi. Kasi magiging dalawa na yung victim. Siya at saka kayo. Okay? So, first, first, titignan nyo muna yung paligid. And then, we want to hear you say, so titingin kayo sa paligid, we want to hear you say, the scene is safe, I am safe. Please repeat, everybody. Do it with the hands. Let's go. The scene is safe, I am safe. Okay? And then you run to the victim. Here. Okay? Paano niyo siya bibisingin? Hindi ganon, ha? Okay? So, tatap lang yung shoulders, sisigawan niyo yung tenga. Parehong tenga. Hindi lang isa kasi baka bini yung isa, yung isa hindi. Ganito lang. Hey, are you okay? Are you okay? okay. Pag hindi siya sumagot sa inyo, dun sa lakas ng top nyo, may problema, di ba? So, yung call for help. Ano yung nakita niyo dun sa video? You call 911. Meron ba tayong 911? Meron. Pag dinayan nyo, meron. Okay? Alright. So, you will say, help, 
call 911. Huwag kayong tuturo kasi it is very impolite. Yung ibang tao ay nating turo ganon. No? So, ganyan lang. Okay? Help, call 911. Please repeat and raise your arms. Help, call 911. Okay? And then, lagay nyo na yung kamay nyo sa chest. And you start, you start CPR. Kung natutulog lang yung tao at nag-start kayo mag-CCPR, magigising siya, magagalit sa inyo. Ano mag ginagawa mo? At least gising mo na, di ba? Pagka hindi siya nagising sa CPR nyo, you have to continue CPR until someone arrive. Kung walang tumulog sa inyo, hindi kayo narinig sa shout for help. So you need to shout very loud. You need to ask for help kasi hindi nyo ka hindi nyo kayang mag-save mag-isa. So, yun lang yung pa-practice natin today. Uh, group 1, stand up. Ngayon one time, huwag mo na kayo nalapis dun sa mati game. Kanyari, hindi pa kayo, you just got out of the movie. Nanood kayo ng Frozen movie. Tapos, yun na rin kayong pagbulungan. Kita nyo, mayroong babae nakahiga sa ground. Okay? So, what is the first thing you do? Check mo muna. Okay? O, if na yung scene, let's begin. The seed is saved. I am saved. Otak ko. Go, go, go. Check responsiveness. Hey! Hey! Are you okay? Are you okay? Hindi sumagot. Call for help. Help! Oh, 911. Okay, and then you put your hands on the chest. Okay. All right, let's go again. Read your seats. Okay. Alam nyo na yung sama yung pupunta. O, sige. We start with the city say, let's go. The city say, I will say. Okay. Sige, start. Let's begin. Okay. Check your sponsor. Hey. 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 So, paano nila nagawa yun? Lahat ng employee ng hospital marunong mag-CPR. So, they took turns for two days until the child was hooked to uh, extracorporeal uh, membrane oxygenator to the ECMO. So, ngayon, nag-aaral na yung bata. So, ma-imagine ang important, the important thing that you know how to do CPR. Okay? You think of yourself first, diba? Check for scene safety. The scene is safe. I am safe. And then, you tap the shoulders. Hey, are you okay? Are you okay? Pag hindi siya sumagot, help, call 911. This time, dahil nakakita na kayo ng AED, idadagdag nyo. Help, call 911. Get an AED. Please repeat. Help! Call 911! Get an AED! And you start CPR. Pag uwi nyo, matatandaan nyo pa kaya kung natutunan natin. Pero kasi, the important thing here is you do CPR right. Yung Chenko, sabi kasi, sabi pag uwi nyo, sabi huwag masyadong mabilis, huwag masyadong mabagal. Paano na yung malalaman? Paano kung matatandaan yung Chenko ng CPR? Di ba? Mas madali. Kung may music, ba? May music kayong iniisip. Yung mga J ay kaninang umaga, yung mga 
ng maagad dumating. Nag-practice kami ng mga panayin. Sino ba silang panoorin? nandito sa chan, mali, di ba? Pwede nyo in a, in a polite way, tulungan kita. Diba? Tapos, huwag na yung masyadong mag-inan. Hindi ganyan. Hindi ganyan, di ba? Nakagalan ka pa. Hindi ganyan. Tuturo ko sa'yo, hindi. Okay? Oh. Any other questions? Yes? Yung, yung 30 counts ba? Ah, 30 compressions. Ah, yun, tinuturo namin. Or you can do it. Q-lev, pating yung tawag doon, airway uh, or barrier. Kasi ngayon, we don't teach people to give mouth-to-mouth -mouth anymore na walang barrier. You know naman why. No? Lalo na kung stranger. Mas importante yung CPR for at least mga 5 minutes. You don't have to give breath to count 100 kaya dapat tuloy-tuloy lang siya ang beat ay makarena tuloy-tuloy lang eh ilang beses niyo lang naman hindi kayo pwedeng makagawa ng 1000 compressions tuloy-tuloy mapapagod kayo di ba okay so that's why kung pagod na ako somebody can take take my place somebody can substitute so kunyari lima kayo dito sa group na marunong mag CPR you can take third okay? Kung walang barrier device, it's okay. You don't have to give mouth-to-mouth -mouth resuscitation. Mouth-to-mouth -mouth rest. Okay? Except, kunyari, kapamilya mo, kaibigan mo, nalunod, tapos hirap, pwede mo bigyan ng mouth-to-mouth. -mouth. Pero yung ordinary circumstances, no? Just CPR. So, I hope you learned a lot today. Okay, uh, may I just request uh, yung I need you to write your name, submit nyo lang sa aking names because we are going to submit that to the American Heart Association. Na kayo nag-take ng hands-only CPR class today, December 7. And we will submit that to the American Heart Association. So guys, Hi! Hi! Hi. <laughs> So we're done uh, the seminar and we will go to another destination which is Sapporo Skull Ata Kineme. So the last part lang ng seminar is the pagkuha ng vital signs na uh, ng tao. <laughs> yung four components of vital signs. Kuha ng vital signs and ng cause kung bakit mahina yung blood uh, pag pump ng heart mo ganun Ano yung balot? <laughs> <laughs> so guys, ganito po utak namin, kakaaral. Ha? Ang ganda yung ano. Ano? 
ganyan na po kapurol. <laughs> Sana all may uterus. Uterus? Ano ang uterus? Uterus yan. Matres. So guys, I'm back again. Yun na. Tapos na ang aming seminar here in UST. And yun. Dami namin natutunan about CPR. The progress and the importance of CPR. CPR. F. CPR. Bye-bye po. Say hi to my vlog po. Hi. Hello. Bye-bye po. Bye. Bye. Anyway. Bye-bye UST. So yun nga, nandito na kami sa bus. We will go home na. May klase pa kami mamay. So yun nga, sana kayo rin may natutunan sa video ko. And yeah. Thank you for watching this video guys. Don't forget to follow my social media accounts. And subscribe to my channel. See you on the next one. Bye!